<clears throat> ah, there we go. All right, it's got all freshed up for Halloween night. Let's do this. All right. We're going to head over to our assigned neighborhood. I am security for the trick-or-treaters to make sure everything goes good and uh, nobody gets lost there. So let's head over there to our assigned neighborhood and check this out. Got my brand new security vehicle here. And uh, yeah, a wonderful night. It's uh, about a good 60 degrees Fahrenheit here. And um, there's a slight breeze in the air. Um, Halloween night, just the general... Uh, general vibe here so we're heading down here and we're almost at our assigned neighborhood just passing by the corn maze they do have these uh holographic ghosts out in the area this was part of the uh mayor's prank or something like that but crossing the bridge here pulling up on the neighborhood stop at the stop sign let's do this and uh pulling into the neighborhood right now so we're gonna go and turn on our cruise lights so everybody knows that we are security um, maybe our rear, but I don't want to blind anybody, but all right, here is security. Looks like they've already got it, gotten an early start on trick-or-treating here. Oh, there's the, uh, some of the costumes. We've got some cool costumes here tonight. All right, and there we go. There we go. All right. How you doing, fellow trick-or-treater? You feeling good tonight? You got your bag almost filled up. Dang, you, you've been out here a while then, huh? Looking good, looking good. Liking the costume, liking the costume. And, uh, got this dude dressed up as, like, a Ghostbuster hot dog. Interesting. Uh, get that vacuum away from me, please. Thank you. And, uh, yeah, very cool. Alright, they got this dude early Christmas, huh? Looking good, looking good. Alright, very awesome there. Got some Austro awesome, uh, Halloween stuff here. Oh, my goodness. Go stay out of the... Oh, hello, how you guys doing? Stay out of the road. I don't want to get run over. You guys enjoying yourself tonight? You guys, I like your guys' costumes. A banana and a wheelchair and a box. Looking awesome. Alright, very, very cool there. I got so much candy. Yeah, I see that. Your bag's almost filled. Go get some more. Go get some more. We're we still going to be out of here a while. I can dance? Awesome. Good for you, man. I'm just having fun. Good to hear. Good to hear. Alright, looking good, guys. Looking good. Got somebody dressed up as Brother Bob over there. Pretty awesome. Very, very awesome there. And, uh, yeah, got a pretty peaceful night. Uh, we have our awesome community out here trick-or-treating on a Joiner and Academy Avenue here. And uh, super awesome. Got some people giving out candy over there. All right. Super cool. Super cool. And I'm just going to go sit in my car. And if anybody needs me, they can go ahead and just uh, knock on the window. All right. I'm going to go and turn on my heat on my car here. Dude, it's kind of cool tonight. I wasn't expecting it to get this chilly here, but... Alright, I'm just gonna play on my phone while... Whoa, whoa, whoa! You okay, ma'am? Yes, yes, ma'am. What can I do for you? You okay? Are you guys okay? I lost my child. Wait, is this your... Is this your husband? He was wearing a cat costume, but we were just trick-or-treating, but I lost him. Okay, alright. It was... You said a cat costume, and where did you guys last see the kid? Alright, where did you last see your kid? Um, I'm gonna go look, okay, behind the woods, like over there, like, or you mean over this way where I'm putting my flashlight, this way, no, this way, interesting, um, huh, okay, all right, ma'am, well, um, here, here, I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna do, I want you to go and stay calm, um, I think your husband already went to, yes, there he is over there, he's going out and looking at the, uh, stuff, Please find him. I know. I know. Keep calm. I'm going to keep my eyes peeled for this, uh, for your son here, okay? All right. So you said it was a cat, uh, cat costume, you said? All right. Yes, okay. So I haven't seen a cat costume yet, but I'll, once again, I'll keep a close eye. Um, go ahead and write down your phone number just in case. Uh, I'll call you if I see anything. Um, I'll let you know, okay? All right. I'll keep a sharp eye. Thank you for telling me. And, uh, see if you could just, just stay calm, okay? We're gonna find him, alright? I'll keep a close eye out. Alright, thank you, thank you. Alright, please find him. Okay, ma'am, you have a good night. We'll stay in contact, okay? Alright, have a good one. Oh, jeez. Alright, now I gotta keep looking for this kid. We're just gonna do a quick, uh... We're gonna do a quick, um... Just look around the neighborhood to see if we can find him. So this woman lost her son... While they were trick-or-treating, and they sit around that way over there. Interesting. Alright, there's more of those ghosts there. 
Very interesting here. Um, let's go ahead and search this way. We're still looking for this kid in a cat costume. She also said with cat ears. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Alright, I don't see any cat costumes. There's that guy waving at us. Alright. We have to go extra slow over here just in case. Um, okay, I don't see any kid with a cat costume. I'm gonna I'm gonna stay on the close lookout though. We've been searching two hours for this kid. All the trick-or-treaters are almost done. Let me go see if I can find that woman again. Whoever that was. Um, where is she at? Oh, she's over there. Ma'am, come over here. Alright. Ma'am, you know what? I haven't found your kid yet. Have you found him at all? No. Okay. Um, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to head over to the police station, and I'm just going to give them the name and the location, and they're going to get some cops on it, okay? So they can search all night long for it. Do you need my ID? No, I don't need anything. I should be good. I'm just going to tell them the information. All right. Thank you, ma'am. I'll talk to you soon. All right. So let's head over to the police station, and we got to give the cops this report of this missing kid. All right. Let's check this out. We're going to head over there real quick, and uh, i got to turn off my cruise because that's not legal anymore. Um, but anyways, let's go ahead over here, and, uh, we're on our way to the, uh, to the police station to go give this missing persons report. Um, interesting. I don't know where the kid could have gone. I really don't. Um, I'm very confused about it, and I'm just gonna see what the cops will say about it. They're gonna get his name on file, and they're gonna go ahead and, uh, get all this stuff, uh, get all this stuff going here with all the paperwork, so... All right, let's go ahead and turn right here. Awesome. And uh, hopefully they're open. I don't know what time they open. It's super late at night. And um, I'm not sure. All right, let's head over here. We're just going to go pull right in here. All right, and boom. All right, we're here at the police station. All right. Uh, hello, sir. Uh, I would like to file a uh, missing persons report, please. Um, who are you? Uh, my name is Josh Morgan. I'm 23 years old. Here's my ID real quick. There you go. And, uh, my name's Josh Morgan. I'm 23 years old. Um, and I'm security for trick-or-treaters over at, a uh, neighborhood C on the south side of town. And, um, I'm here to file a missing persons report. This mom came up to me and, um, she was, uh, she was saying how she couldn't find her kid and all that stuff, and I was wondering if you guys would be able to send out a couple officers to actually go out and look for this, uh, look for this kid here. Do you think that would be possible by chance? Or can I at least talk to somebody who would, you know? Okay, one second, gotcha. Yeah, I don't know. Alright, follow me. Perfect. I don't know when the kid actually went missing or all, but we'll see what happens. Alright. Um, when we sit down here? Just sit down here, okay. All right, there we go. All right, thank you, sir. <sighs> all right, I'm kind of nervous. I'm not really, like, into the police and all that stuff, but... Oh, no, he's watching on the other side. All right. Um, hello, officers. How you guys doing today? All right, what's up? Um, so, I'm here to file a missing persons report for this kid. Um, we're going to uh, ask you a couple questions. Oh, okay, sounds good. Perfect. So, yeah. Like I said, my name's Josh Morgan. I'm 23 years old. Um, and, uh, yeah, okay, he's writing stuff down, too. Um, so I'm security for, for uh, Neighborhood C over there on the south side of town. And um, this woman, I have her number, but I didn't grab her name by chance. She came up to me, and she said, hey, I can't find my kid. Are you able to take a look and look around the neighborhood for him? So this was about uh, 9.46 p.m. or so. And, um, I've been looking for two hours and I'm exhausted and I can't find the kid at all. Um, okay. Do you have a description of what the kid, what they were wearing over the last scene? So, yeah. So the mom said that the kid was wearing a cat costume with like cat ears. Do you know what I mean? Like cat, uh, cat headband or whatever. And, um, they said they were last known in the woods 
by uh, behind, I forget what house it was, but it's a blue house. And it's the only blue house in the whole neighborhood, so you shouldn't be able to miss it. Um, they said the kid was behind the woods and they just lost him. Um, they didn't, they didn't say any, they didn't say anything about if they heard anything or nothing. They just said he disappeared. And I don't know what's going on. All right, we could check CCTV, but at the moment, oh no. Um, listen, we would go out and look for the kid, but we've been super overwhelmed with reports lately. Therefore, we might be able to send out a search party, search party to look for the kid. Are you guys able to write his name down or something at least? At least, like, keep an eye out for him. He's most likely out trick-or-treating anyway, so he'll probably be, be back home soon. It's normal with kids these days. They want all the candy. Yeah, that's true, but I feel like the mom didn't really think her kid would do that. And, I mean, trick-or-treating is wrapping up here in about 10 minutes, so I obviously guess we'll see then. However, we'll put his name in the files, like with all the others. All right. I really wish you guys could do something, but I totally understand if you guys are overwhelmed. I just really feel bad for this couple, and they were just super scared about their kid, and um, I was just, you know, feeling bad about them, I guess. Um, there's been about five disappearances within the last four hours. It's been very strange. Wait. Wait, what? Five disappearances? That's never happened. We barely even have one every Halloween. I've been doing the security job for like three or four years and that's never happened. That's interesting. I've never, never heard of that. Um, some strange things have been happening recently. I guess, man, it's, you know, Halloween time. Everything's getting busy, so. All right, well, um, thank you guys. Do you guys have any other questions to ask? Um, we'll look over the CCTV footage anyway. Okay, yeah, that's, I mean, that's the best you guys can do. So I appreciate it, guys. Thank you guys so much. Um, we'll let you know if you find any. Okay. Uh, go ahead and take my phone number here. Take my phone number. Please call me. Even if you find the most stupidest thing, please call me because it might help me, okay? Um, thank you guys so much for everything. All right. I appreciate it. Uh, we'll keep in contact. Let me know. All right. Yes. Thank you, sir, for your time as well. You guys have a good one, okay? All right. Take care, guys. Alright, it's getting pretty late. I think I'm just going to head home. Um, take the night off. It's been a long night. And uh, I feel so bad for those parents. Whoa. What was that scream? Did you guys hear that? Wait, was that coming from outside? Okay, hold up. Let me put on a coat real quick because it's cold out. Let me get my coat here. What was that? It sounded like a girl or something. Like I got my flashlight too. Hello? It sounded like it was coming from the back of the house. Who's that? Ma'am? What are you doing out? It's two in the morning. What are you doing? My son is in the maze. I heard screaming coming from the inside. What are you doing out here at two in the morning? Oh my gosh. I'm sure he's in there. Ma'am, there's no way he's in the maze. Why would he go into the corn maze? Ma'am, you need to go home and get some sleep. It's late. I don't know. He comes in here with his kids. Or with his friends. Huh. Ma'am, have you been up all night looking for this guy? Looking for your son? Yes? You gotta go to bed. We can't... Listen. I won't sleep until he's found. Well... I can't go in that maze. He's not in there. It's a corn maze at 3 in the morning. Almost 3 in the morning. Please, I'm sure. Okay, listen. We'll look quick, but I'm not searching a long time in here. Because I'm tired and I want to go to bed. Okay? Alright. Now let's just go slowly. Alright. What is the kid's name? 
I don't even know. Um, Jake. Alright. Jake, you in here, buddy? Oh, this is so stupid. He's not in here. Jake, you in here? Why would the kid be in a corn maze at almost 3 in the morning? Jake, you here? Hello? I don't see him. He's not in here, ma'am. Jake? We'll go this way. Let's go this way. Jake, you here? Hello? I'm sure of it. Ma'am, you need to go get some sleep. You're just hearing things. Jake? Oh my goodness, this is so stupid. Hello, Jake? Jake? Wait, is that him? Is that him? I don't know. That kind of scared me. Wait, you need a closer look. But is that Jake? Does he have that outfit on? He's in a cat costume. Is there any way he could have got a farm worker outfit? I don't know. Alright, listen. I'm gonna go see if I can talk to the dude. I don't know who that is. Just stay behind me. Hello? What is that flashing light? Hello? Sir, we're uh, we're looking for a kid named Jake. Have you seen him? This guy's freaking me out. Hello? I don't know. I don't know who that. I don't know who that would be. I right, turn your flashlight. I turn your flashlight off. Sir, listen, we're looking for a kid named Jake. Have you seen him? What do we do? Alright, I'm gonna go see if I can... Maybe, I don't know if he just... Maybe doesn't hear us. Sir? Who is this guy? Wait, do you see that blood on his pitchfork? Alright. Let's just... Sir? Sir? Oh my gosh, get out of here! Get out of here! Run! No way! No way! Get out of here! Get out of here! Get out of here! What is going on? Who was that? Who was that? Why was he wearing a mask? Hang on a second! Hang on a second! Who was that? Wait, ma'am! Oh no, uh-uh. Uh-uh, I don't mess with this stuff. I'm calling the cops. Huh, I'm in my pajamas? I can't do this. What even is that? There's a... There's a weird man... In the... In the corn maze? Is that... I don't even... I don't even know? I just called 911. I don't know who that was. Oh, no. I'm freaking out. Am I seeing things? I don't know. Where did that girl go? I'm so alone out here. Where did that girl go? Cops over here, over here, over here. Officers. Listen. There's somebody in there and he's taken a hold of this woman. You guys got to search the corn maze. You guys got to go in. Just go in, just go in. He's in there. He is in there, I swear, I just saw him. Oh my gosh, I can't believe this. This is unbelievable. I'm in my pajamas out here in the freezing cold. And there's something in this maze. 
corn maze. Nobody is nobody lives on the farm. The farm has been abandoned for years. Do you guys find anything? No? You guys didn't even s oh. Come on. It's you. Yeah. Wait, you're the dude who Josh, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude. Th okay. Listen, that woman that was that had the lost kid, she's in there. Somewhere. I don't know where she is. But there's somebody in there. Did you guys find anyone? Where's the woman? She's inside. This figure appeared and he had a pitchfork with blood on it. We couldn't find anyone. Oh, no. You're kidding me. What happened? Why the heck are you at the corn maze at midnight? It's closed. I know. It's like 3 in the morning and this woman, she started screaming. And she said she, she, said she heard her kid. She's in there. There's another cop over there. Did he find anything? Sir, did you find anything? Are you sure you really heard screaming? Yeah, I swear! I, I didn't just not hear screaming. Um... You're probably just tired and are hallucinating. Go drink some water and get some sleep, alright? We can't be having this anymore. This sounds more fake than it is. You guys are messing with me. Come on. You guys are seriously not believing me? Oh, sorry. Come on. Oh, jeez. Okay. Alright. Go to sleep before we arrest you for making prank. Oh, come on. Okay. Come on. Alright. You know what? Alright. Fine, I'll just go to bed then. Sorry for messing with you guys. Alright, sorry. I guess. You guys have a good night. Alright. What just happened? Yeah, you guys can get out of here. What just happened? Hang on, I gotta go wake myself up or something. I can't believe this. Wait a minute, what was that? Was that... Wait, hold up. Was that crying? The cops are gone. Wait, do I hear crying over there? Hang on a minute. Wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. Wait, I see a light. Who is this? Wait, if it's that farmer dude. Um... All right, you know what? I got this. Three, two, one. <gasps> Wait. Wait, ma'am? What are you doing? Help me, my son is in there, but he isn't alive. Forget about me, just take this guy down. Wait. No, no, no. Uh-uh, uh-uh. What are those stab marks? Did he stab you? Wait, she's not breathing. Oh, no. If that guy comes around that corner right now, I'm dead. You know what? Uh-uh. You know what? I'm going to get my gun. I'm not messing around. I'm not messing around no more. I am going to get my gun. All right, all right, hang on, hang on, hang on. All right. You know what? Let's do this. All right. Let's find this dude. I'm not messing around no more. The time is now. Where is this guy? Where is this dude at? Let's go back to where we first saw him. Where did he... Where is this dude? I'm not messing around. Hey, scary dude, if you can hear my voice right now, I have a Glock 17, and it's loaded just for you. So I would suggest you put down your pitchfork and put your hands in the air. Where's this guy at? 
Where is this dude? Hang on. This is where he was before. Let's see if we can find him. Three, two, one. Where is he at? Hello? Anyone there? Hello? Anybody? Where is this dude at? I'm not going down without a fight. I'm searching this entire maze if I have to. Hello? Anyone there? Hello? Anybody? Um. Whoa, wait, 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 wait. What was that? Wait, no, 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 no. What was that? Wait. Is that a guy's head? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. I don't mess with this stuff, dude. Uh-uh. Wait a minute. Is that a cat out? No way. That's the kid. Laying there dead with blood all over him. That's the kid. Oh, no, dude. All right, you know what? I'm going to get I'm going to do it. I think this guy's around the corner, but he doesn't know I'm here. It's time to take this into my own hands. I got to do this. 3 2 and 1. Oh my gosh. Who are you? Wait a minute. One, two, three, four, five. The other five missing people. Who are you? What are you doing? They all have pitchfork like wounds. Dude, put your hands in the air right now. I'm not messing around. Listen, put your hands in the air. And who are you? Why are you doing this? What is going on? What is going on? You know what? You know what? Who are you? I want to know who you are first. You know what? I want you to do one thing for me. You got it? I don't know if you speak English or what, or if you even talk. But what I want you to do right now is I want you to lower the lantern and take off that mask do it right now take off the mask <laughs>